Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Today I'm gonna to be showing you guys how to make uh, a GUI uh, visible when a part is touched. So it's a pretty simple thing. I think it makes the games look a lot better. Usually in games, I like to see them more in games now. Whenever there's a shop, for example, you would see there's a shop label, there's like a building, and then they just add this like general circle in it on the ground. You just step into it, and uh, the shop opens. And it's really nice. I think it makes games look like a lot more futuristic and, and a lot more like, um, actually made like uh it looks like they've put a lot of time into it it looks detailed it's nice and uh yeah and it's pretty nice uh it's pretty easy too so uh it's only like a five or four i believe six line uh, yeah, i don't remember exactly but like a script is so small the script so um yeah it's, let's get started now first off we want to make our gui so as you can see guys i'm i haven't made the gui or anything so you guys know this is real right or something and uh, you want to insert a screen GUI inside that. I'm gonna insert a frame. Now for this frame, I'm not really gonna do much. I'm just gonna just keep it in the center, I guess. Um, now for this video, I'm not gonna be adding the the close button because I don't really think there's a point for that right now. Uh, so yeah. Now once I'm for example, for example, I'm done my GUI. Now what you guys wanna do? Make sure to uh, insert a local script inside of starter GUI, not the screen GUI. That's where a lot of people mess up. They put it inside the screen UI and, and then it won't work. So what you guys want to do is um, local part. Oh, actually, sorry, I forgot one part too. Uh, if you guys click on this icon real quick, so it disappeared, disables the GUIs for a sec. Make sure to insert your part because uh, I forgot to do that. So I'm just gonna quickly make something random. I'm just gonna make it pretty big so it's not laggy or something. It doesn't glitch out or something. And uh, yeah, that's pretty good. Make sure it's the exact name, so it's mine, basically by default, it's part with a capital P. I'm going to click on this icon again. I'm going to go back to the local script. So I'm going to do local part is equal to game dot uh, workspace, actually, dot part. And there you guys. So for example, if your part's name is object, you would change it right over here. So because you're just defining, you're defining it right now. So next, what you want to do is part dot touched connect function and then inside the bracket is gonna be nothing so you just want to go straight down and this is the last line so it's script dot parent dot screen ui uh dot frame dot visible is equal to true there now this is the script it's i know it looks so small and it's so much better now now uh, make sure your frame is if you go scroll down properties make sure it's invisible so you can't see it and um actually yeah so what i'm gonna do now is i know i can just play it i'm gonna play it here because we might spawn like we might land on the thing and it won't really show if it worked and uh so i'm gonna spawn a little far from the uh, part so as you can see i'm over here and um yeah so there's no gui now the second i touch this part i can see the gui has appeared now obviously because i don't have the close button i can't really um close it yet um but I can just do that. I don't think that works in in game or in test mode or something. Um, but yeah, I don't know how to do the animations yet. I know they look terrible with the animations. I'm gonna be trying to figure out how to do the animations. I don't know myself either. Um, <clears throat> sure. And uh, yeah. So, but the second I do find out, I'll be making a video on it so you guys can know. Also, it's pretty simple. Hopefully, I think. Um, but yeah, it's basically it, guys. So we're so close to 380 subscribers. So be sure to like and subscribe. 380. Why do I why do I always mess up my subscriber count? What the heck? Man? It's 480. All right. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with my brain. All right. So uh, 480 subscribers, guys. We're so close. Be sure to like and subscribe. We're so close to 500 subscribers too. Um. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to like and subscribe. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.